Hi guys, it's Steffi from The Novelty Corner and welcome back to another Read Digital Challenge. This is the May challenge where for one week I try to read nothing but digital text, be they ebooks, audiobooks, webcomics, fanfic, whatever it takes my fancy. For me, it means trying to get through my Kindle reads, occasionally with an audiobook thrown in, because I have a lot of books unread on my Kindle and I just keep adding to them. So this is a way of getting through that digital TBR. Every month I have a bingo board. I also post this on my blog at the start of every month so people can have the challenge as well in advance if you would like to participate. It's usually the last week every month for this week, for this month it is taking place from the 24th until the 30th of May and it's just a celebration of all digital bookish things so I hope you'll join in. I'm going to share the prompts and what I am currently planning on reading for those prompts but know that I do change my TBR pretty liberally throughout that reading week because I am a mood reader. Also, if I decide that I'm not enjoying something, I'm not gonna keep reading it for the sake of finishing a set TBR. I'm gonna switch it out for something else. So it's a very casual reading challenge. You can do as much or as little as you would like for it. You don't even have to do the prompts if you just wanna read your digital books and you've got some that you know you've been meaning to get to. The prompts are just there for people who like a bit of a challenge, like me. The first challenge is Own Voices, and for this I'm going to read The Worst Best Man by Mia Sosa, which is a contemporary romance book. The next challenge is to read an intimidating book, and for that I'm going to read Lock Every Door by Riley Sager, because I don't traditionally read mystery thrillers. I mean, I do occasionally, but it's not something I reach for, so this is on my Kindle, I'm going to try and read it. For the challenge, Someone Else's Favourite Book, I'm going to read The Rivers of London by Ben Ar Aronovich. I think is how you say his last name. I actually have this on my Kindle and I have the audiobook, so I might do a combination of both re reading this. Pretty sure that that is sort of an urban fantasy story, series, etc. For a non-fiction book, I am planning on reading The Science of Star Wars by Mark Brake. I think this was like one of those Kindle deals that I found, or it could have been a BookBub deal. So I just, I grabbed it because I knew at some point I was going to have to have a non-fiction book and I'd like to read a Star Wars one. I haven't yet decided what I'm going to read for the free choice square. I'm going to leave that one open so that I can literally pick from anything on my Kindle, whatever takes my fancy. For the prompt food on the cover, I'm going to read Sugar Rush by Donna Kaufman. Now I'm not entirely sure if my edition has food on the cover. I know that one of the editions definitely has cupcakes and also sugar is a part of food. So I'm just going to play that loosely. It was really literally the only thing that I had with food sort of mentioned somewhere on the cover. So We'll go with that. For the challenge, a book starting with D, I'm going to read The Devil's Daughter by Katie Robert, which is a romantic suspense book. For a book by an Indigenous author, I'm going to possibly reread The Trail of Lightning by Rebecca Roanhorse, which is an urban fantasy story with Native American mythology woven into it. I do really love the series and I would like to reread it. I don't think I have anything else by an Indigenous author on my Kindle, but if that changes, I may swap it out and read something new. Otherwise, I would like to reread it. And for the challenge female main character, I am planning on reading Fortuna Sworn by KJ Sutton. This was a book that Kelsey Sutton actually sent to me for review, so I would like to try and read at least the first part. I believe it is a paranormal romance, urban fantasy type story, so I'm very eager to try it. And I know that Becca from over at Becca and Her Books has also been talking about this series. So I do have the first two books. I would like to try and read the first one. So that is my current TBR for the Read Digital May challenge. Let me know in the comments if you are participating and if you have any books that you're planning on reading. Remember you do not have to attempt to read nine books. I just like setting myself a challenge and also I just want to read as many books as possible off my Kindle. So having a TBR sometimes helps with that otherwise it tends to change. I hope that if you feel like it you will participate and join in. I really enjoy this week. Honestly I just find it to be a really cruisy reading week when I just read my digital texts. So I hope that wherever you are in the world you're having a wonderful day and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye guys.